these things can last you a lot of years. We say sort of an average of seven, but they could last a lot longer if you take care of it. And a big part of that is making sure you take care of it in the winter so that it doesn't crack. Uh, this is particularly important in, um, in Calgary. We just have all that freeze thaw. So that really does a number on these things. I um, empty the barrels um, as much as I can into containers or something that I'll use probably inside uh, for my indoor plants because I do use it all year for them as well. Uh, to get as much of that water as I can, um, empty the rest into my tree. Um, and then I take, I take all the ports off and I put them in my garage because I just don't want water to get um, caught in between there. I know you don't have to, it's just an extra step I like to do. Uh, so then I flip it over. Um, and I just leave them out all winter long, flipped upside down, so that any water that comes or snow, it doesn't drip into the barrel, it's on top, it melts off of it. And I've had some of those barrels, um, they're all between 12 and 15 years old, um, and that's how they've been stored their whole life. This gives them, you know, another 5, 10, 15 years of life doing something before they get recycled. So they're still getting recycled in the end, but it just you know, makes them a, a more useful tool for a longer period of time. I think it's, it's great. I think it's wonderful. I think we should all be using the, you know, it's, it's there, it's happening, it's coming down. There's so many benefits, not just to our own gardens, but like as an environmental, a bigger picture, there's so many benefits. So the more of us that do it, the, um, the more benefit it is to the environment.